they're having to do a little bit of a defending in the early stages and trying a snapshot there was uh, the Burton man and it's into the net and they've taken the lead on the one minute mark well a big surprise there Ramsey is from Great Bar local lad is brother Aaron in the academy as well great opportunity to him he found Lansbury well there who exchanges passes with Watkins Watkins now looking sharp plays the pass it's a good one the low ball in towards Ramsey stretching and straining on his first start would have loved a goal then he hasn't gone for Burton Taylor the experienced Wales international hits it low not too far from the quarter hour mark at the Pirelli the Brewers lead the villains by one goal to nil Jacob Ramsey sitting deep did well the youngster Grealish off he goes now this could spell danger for Burton Grealish might just go all the way here into the penalty area Jack Grealish hits it low good block and it's behind for a corner in comes the corner, up goes Courtney Hawes, can't win it, his fellow central defender Tyrone Mings, he brought that down beautifully, brilliant control from Mings, then he steers the cross in, away only as far as Grealish, Jack Grealish the captain, bent him in a beauty of a ball, Courtney Hawes couldn't keep his header down, that's Villa's best chance of the game, marvellous. Al Ghazi, early ball in towards Watkins, it was ready there. Will the ball break for Villa? No, but it's back now with Grealish and Neil Taylor. Grealish uses his body well. Good persistence there from Grealish to keep the ball for the Villains. Can he pick out the pass? Here he can for Taylor. Taylor now. And Ollie Watkins has a debut goal. The simplest of tasks to score from close range. Grealish inevitably involved. Taylor, the fullback, got into a great area, kept his composure. And Watkins, he made a habit of that in the championship, being in the right place at the right time. That's why the Villa fans are so excited about him joining the club. His Premier League debut still to come, but in the Carabao Cup, he's on target at the Pirelli Stadium to open his Villa account. It's Burton 1, Villa 1. Villa have lost the ball here and now Burton looking to retake the lead and it's with Lawless and now the run made by Ryan Edwards Ryan Edwards goes to the curler and Nyland's there to palm it away and now he's looking to get the better of his man what a dribble Grealish might go all the way oh! with the comeback and Ollie Watkins can't make it too well Grealish fresh from signing his new contract was magnificent there running across the byline he fed Watkins and it's hit the top of the crossbar from the summer signing. But Grealish, well, the initial control was superb. He glided past Ben Fox as if he wasn't there. Then he put it on a plate for Watkins, who just lifted his head, couldn't keep the shot down. That should really have been Villa with the advantage at the break. And they'll still feel they're right in this cup tie. Here's Tyrone Mings with the header, doesn't get any pace on it though, and he's back with Kane Hemmings. Hemmings is in here, tight angle, but he couldn't force a save from Nyland. Al Mohamedy, good lofted ball, Grealish brought it down and then he hits it, wow, I think that might have been a shot, only he knows. Aikens now surging through the middle, excellent pace from him, outside of the boot, plays the ball, Ball back to Aikens, excellent block, that's good defending Tyrone Mings. Hit towards Grealish, but Burton have it, and they played it for Powell. Powell into the penalty area, tries to cut back, that's really good defending. Grealish, good work. And now it's Hotterall, hits it just over the bar, good strike that from the sub, wasn't far away. Potter, but only as far as Marvellous. Slots the pass for Tyrone Mings in the penalty area. Mings knocks it now for Keenan Davis. His shot takes a deflection and tipped over the bar. It's a corner. Another corner for Villa. Henry Lansbury hits it. Grealish on the volley. He's done it. That's the way to celebrate your new contract. Mr. Aston Villa books Villa's place 
in the third round of this season's Carabao Cup. He said earlier he loves the club, it's his home. He lives and breathes the mighty Clariton Blue, and he did the business there for his team. This was very much in the balance. Burton scored early on. Watkins got a goal to level things up. And when his team required his services, up stepped Jack Grealish. Cotter. Lansbury now, and it's with Keenan Davis. Keenan Davis in, he should make it three here and does. Keenan Davis rounds off the night for Aston Villa. He's come on and made an impact off the bench. Villa, well, they've left it late here. It was 1-1 for a long time, but Davis showed composure there. He had oceans of space into the penalty area, drew the keeper and just slotted calmly into the net. And Aston Villa, having made it all the way to Wembley last season, have seen off a plucky Burton challenge.